Welcome back to my channel if you are new. Hey, my name is Courtney and then today I am doing a drugstore makeup routine for school. Um, there are like two or ten to twelve dollars, but those that is the most expensive drugstore product. Other than that, everything is under ten dollars, which is really great. And yeah, if you guys would like to see how I get my flawless drugstore everyday makeup, then just keep watching. So first I'm going to use this prep and hydrate balm. Since I have a really dry skin, I have to use like a moisturizer, but I have not found a really good moisturizer that, that I like. So we're just gonna try this. This is something I have not tried before. Okay, so this is really cooling. Okay, this has given me so much hydration and I literally, after just trying this for two seconds, I really like it. So we're just going to wait and Wait a couple minutes for it to dry. Next, I'm going to use the e.l.f. concealer, and this is the e.l.f. Perfect Blend Concealer, and this is in light beige. I don't really use concealer, but on days like this, I need to. I'm just going to do it. Put it in the skin, and cover my face. this. Perfect. Wow, this is really creamy, and it blends in so well, which is why I like this. Looks like you don't even have anything on, which is great. And then I just picked up a new e.l.f. eyebrow pencil. This is great. I think it was only $2. Since I already um, did my eyebrows earlier because I went to work earlier, I'm just going to fluff them up and add them or just do a little bit more to my eyebrows. Anyways, next is the e.l.f. finishing powder and this is in light and it just looks like this. Um, for my dry skin, I really don't like using any powders, but since I am going to be inside all day working, I need something for my face so it doesn't get too dewy. And then I'm just going to use the Morphe G5 brush and put this all over my face, especially or under my eyes where I had the concealer. Normally, I don't wear concealer. But some days your girl just needs to wear concealer, you know? So now I'm just putting it all over my face. Oh, it just turned my face so matte. And that looks really good. Okay. Now that the finishing powder I'm is... I'm going to use the Voluminous Lash Paradise by L'Oreal, I think. Yes, by L'Oreal. Mascara is definitely something you need to splurge on. If you guys have not seen my comparison video of trying this um, mascara to a high-end mascara, I will link it in the info box up above me, and I will link it down below. It's a really good video if you guys want to see a dupe for a high-end makeup to see which mascara this dupes definitely check that video. I do not have a drugstore highlighter. I don't know why I'm just addicted. I just really like higher end highlighters, but this MAC tra um, travel size is only $12, which is pretty cheap compared to Physicians Formula makeup. So if you want to consider this a drugstore, I definitely would. This is the mini, the $12. So it has lasted me a long time. So now I'm just going to put it in my highlight areas, my nose, definitely highlight that. So the last thing is lips and I kind of have two different drugstore lip products I have been loving the past two months and that is the Pacifica Color Quince Lip Tint in Guava Berry. This adds so much moisture to your lips and it has Adds, it's like your lip color, but prettier. So oh, pretty, I really love it. And it smells delicious, like, it smells so good. <sighs> so that is all for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you like this drugstore makeup routine, please give it a like and subscribe down below. And tell me your favorite drugstore products. I would like to know what you guys like to use, and maybe I'll pick them up in my next haul.